Right, Mars and moon tubes are about 100 to 1,000 times wider than the ones found here on Earth, like in Hawaii, for example. Uh, these lava tubes. Uh, now, NASA, they've already talked about how they're going to, you know, occupy this subterranean world on the moon. Right here's an example put out by NASA. You see the lava lava tube there down there at the bottom and, uh, you know, solar panels up top and whatnot. They've talked about the Artemis project, how they're going to, you know, explore these caves in the subterranean world on the moon, you know. But I think there's already bases there. I think they've already, you know, had secret missions to explore these caves, you know, probably during the Apollo missions. You know, who knows right here? Here's a hamster ball. They're going to drop down in the caves. OK, getting to it. I'm trying to kind of burn through it quick today, guys. Uh, I posted a video about uh, maybe two or three days ago, can't remember, and uh, you know, people wanted me to zoom in, to enhance the video, right, to give you another look, and I've done that. I've also talked to the original uploader, um, and, and he told me, you know, basically, he's using a, a Nikon 1000 camera, right? The Nikon, an awesome camera, I wanna get one, by the way, but uh, that's what he found, and it, it can only be seen certain times of the year you know this everything's got to be got to be perfect right the lighting the clouds the you know the rotation of the earth everything needs to be perfect to see what we're looking at here now to the right there it looks like another cave entrance okay so when i was looking around you guys asked me to make a follow-up i'm glad i did because when i was uh doing my editing i saw what to me looks like another cave entrance okay it's crazy right um Elon Musk, SpaceX, you know, they're talking about boring on the moon. Well, why? They, I don't think they need to because there's already, you know, uh, the, these caves, these tunnels, tunnels on the moon that are miles and miles long. So, you know, what is going on up there? Now, here's the original video right here. Um, and again, I'll leave my conversation with the original uploader at the end of the video. You know, we were texting back and forth and he gave me a little bit of information and, um, you know how he filmed it and whatnot the reason it's a, it's a little unstable is because he, again he's using a handheld nikon 1000 camera without a tripod so i was able to stabilize it and uh you know zoom in of course you know he already he zoomed in as much as he could with the camera but then i came back and zoomed in even further you know added a few filters here and there to bring you guys all the details like always but it's amazing you know i'm fascinated with the moon and uh of course we're going back in 2024 with the artemis project and uh they're gonna have these uh you know vr moon robots with 4k cameras um talking about building lunar bases on the moon you know a lot of exciting things going on but why you know why and, and again spacex coming out saying they want to you know basically bore they want to bore tunnels on the moon and mine the moon for different uh, metals and minerals and things like that you know so why the sudden interest now spacex said it's because you know they want to use the moon as practice for Mars. Okay, sounds good to me, but why? You know, we know there was an ancient civilization on Mars and most likely on the moon, especially the back side of the moon, the dark side of the moon. Um, I believe there is alien life back there. There's already bases on the moon. Um, at a bare minimum, they're doing some type of, you know, secret experiments and projects on the moon. At a, at a bare minimum you know so when we see these things here to me it's validation it adds credibility to that theory that uh, you know there's definitely something going on uh, on our, our moon you know the earth satellite the lunar surface whatever you want to call it and, and it's a fact okay it's a scientific fact that there are miles and miles and miles of tunnels lava tunnels uh, you know, probably millions of years old that are already on the moon. And again, it, it's a perfect habitat, you know, for, for NASA, 